for sure. But I've actually talked about you too much because you interviewed Talked Brian. about me? Yeah, because yeah. you interviewed Brian and you asked a couple of really cool questions that I had never heard about. Um, about the fact when they did the back end vocals and there's like 48 tracks and yeah, but now let's do the other side. <laughs> do the right channel, yeah. That's so we recorded 48 tracks of one background vocal. I think it was... Thought I died and gone to heaven, the, the chorus. Right. And then finished it, and I was like, wow, that, that sounds great. And he goes, well, that's the left channel. <laughs> that's yeah, a great exactly. story. I, yeah, and I, I called Mutt the day after for some other reason. I said, oh, by the way, I saw this interview, and I, I talked about your interview, and he says, well, yeah, it sounds about right. So, you know, he sort of confirmed the whole thing. Wow, that's, that's hilarious. hilarious. Mitch, yeah, Mutt Lang it, knows of me. Yeah. <laughs> that's right. But the coolest thing that Mutt's ever done, and we're talking about Balls of Steel, is what Brian said. I'm not sure about this verse, and Mutt deletes the analog tape. Yeah. Like punches in, punches out. And and to do that, if you know what we're doing in the studio, it's like... Just left the drums, like... <laughs> that, that's like... Okay. But it was funny, cool. Brian's reaction to that, because I was like, well, what, it was just gone? He's like, that's gone. I'm like, do you remember what the melody was? Like, no idea. I just know that it wasn't good enough, so we deleted it and started from scratch. Yeah. <laughs> that's yeah, nuts. Well, He's not thinking of box sets and, and deluxe editions. He's got to really <laughs> save this stuff. It's very important. Yeah. It's very important. Yeah, yeah exactly. An all-new episode of the Mitchell Fun and Jeremy White Show. Tuesday at noon. Available wherever you stream.